This is Jessica Hall, and you're watching Jay Hall's Jam on UCLABruins.com. Jay Holla! Hi, welcome to the third episode of The Jam. I'm Jessica Hall, and with me today is sophomore catcher Maddie Mobley. Maddie, thanks for joining us. Of course. Uh, this last weekend, the Bruins faced the Arizona Wildcats, one of the biggest rivalry series we'll probably face all year. We ended up winning the series two out of the three games. The first one, the Bruins ended up losing in 10 innings. It was a great game. We got a little more fire in us the next day, coming out swinging our sticks. The Bruins uh, set a record of seven home runs that game. We ended up taking the second game and went on to take the third, taking the series as well. We ended up beating the Wildcats in six innings. That's the first time they've been mercied at home since 1999. Uh, it was also done then by UCLA. Maddie, this year you've seemed to take on a role as captain of the dugout. Uh, what job and what requirements does that come with throughout the game? Well, just, you know, I don't have a voice right now because that's part of the requirements. It's an upbeat zone at all times and we try and keep it the same whether we're up or down so we can just have the most fun and take the opponent out. Nice. Yeah, we seem to have a lot of fun in that dugout. This weekend was a high energy weekend. I think we wanted it a little bit more for multiple reasons. We set a lot of records this weekend. We did, it was a lot of fun and you could tell the difference in the two dugouts and I definitely would pick the Bruins every time. We had a great time. Another thing that you brought into the dugout this weekend was the Lisa Fernandez bobblehead. Tell us a little bit about that. So, I don't know if all of you know, but Lisa just had her baby, little baby Cruz, and she can't be with us um, on the road right now. She's at home with little Cruz. So what we did is we brought Lisa with us, and she has a little bobblehead that we hold for good luck. She's always with us. She sees it, and I guess they really like to talk about it on TV. So Lisa's causing quite a stir, and she's not even in Tucson with us. Yep, she definitely made a debut on ESPN still. We are coming up on our senior weekend. We open with Oregon. We have two seniors, Devin Linval and BB Bates, that we will be announcing and honoring this weekend. We'll definitely come out playing for them, dedicating uh, the weekend to them and just everything that they've accomplished. I think this weekend's gonna be really interesting for Devin because her sister is the catcher right. on Oregon, so it's probably gonna mean a little more to have senior weekend at home with her sister on the other team. Right. Oregon is ranked higher than us, so we're hoping that we can take the series and hopefully move our rankings up as well as we are approaching closer to postseason. So we're hoping to have a great series with our senior weekend. Join us next week for more information on that at UCLABruins.com. <laughs>